Hey, what's up, chess lovers? Just want to guys give you a quick intro. Really cool video we have for you today on some visualization skills and practices. Let us know what you guys think about it in the comments and sections below. Okay, so you are you are down for some punishment here, yeah? Yeah, yeah. This is kind of scary. You're, you're not you're not shied away by this. I, I, I'm I'm a little concerned already, to be honest. If I could be okay, um, fair. Yeah. You should be. <laughs> oh boy. Sorry. Oh, I got something stuck there. <laughs> <laughs> Your ball. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, so we had this thing that we found when you were trying to calculate some defensive puzzles, where you would get cloudy in your calculation. Pretty early on, it was like two or three moves in. Yeah, <laughs> and we want to, we want to, we want to clarify that. We need some glasses for that. I, I wish you could just slap glasses on it. That would make it a heck of a lot easier. Um, but what we have to do is we have to train your vision of the board. Yeah, did you watch the Queen's Gambit? I, I just finished it last night, actually, which is depressing. I know it took me too long. And and when she when she's like playing chess on the ceiling. Yeah. That's the stuff we're talking about. Oh, okay. So we're just gonna play blindfold. It, it, it doesn't take blindfold chess skills to do it. <laughs> no, not exactly. I know. I know. I'm sorry. This is gonna hurt, and and it's only we're we're gonna do it for a really brief time. So hopefully it won't uh, it won't leave any damage. You can't, you can't damage me already more than uh, <laughs> than college did. So. <laughs> right, right, right. Now, uh, so so here's the deal. I want you to to look at the chessboard. And very quickly here, glance at the square A1. Mm -hmm. And tell me what color it is. It's black. Black, okay. We've got a black square at A1. Now, you have to either hide the board with something, with another window, or look away. All right, my hands are from the face. look at the chessboard for this. All right. What uh, color is the square C2? Try to count your way over from A1. It's black. Right? So A, nope, hold on. Go A's, slowly, go slowly. Yeah. A's black, B's white, C's black, C2 is white. Yeah, it's a white square. So now you got to try to visualize when you do that, when you're moving over the squares, you got to try to visualize the colors as you change, changing as you go over. So A, B, C, C2. Okay, so A, C, E, F, or, or white. <laughs> Oh my gosh, AB. I don't even know my alphabet. I don't even, I don't even know my alphabet. Oh my god, this is gonna be really hard. <laughs> F A C E is like the that's like the bass clef, you know, reading notes up the chart, right? I haven't had music theory in so long. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I was wrong. It was B D F and H. Oh my god, it's so terrible. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, counting my twos. Here we go. All right, now go from C two where you are. Just keep keep visualizing. Walk up to E four. Okay, so E2 is white, so that means C3 is, I'm sorry, D, so C3, so C2 is white, D3 is white, then E4 is white. Yeah, that's a good way to do it, is to walk up a diagonal. You can also just go all the, do all the squares. Go from, go from E4 all the way over to B5. E4... D4 is black, C4 is white, B4 is black, B5 is white. Right. Now I'm going to tell you two squares, and I want you to look in your mind, just in your mind's eye. Try, try to figure it out without counting if you can. Decide whether the square B5 that you're currently on and F2, if they're on the same diagonal or not. So B is there. It's on the it's on the the night. And then you said which one was the other one? F two. F two. The bishop. Um. So H is dark. So that means G is light. F is light. So yeah, I, th I think they are actually. Yeah, take a look at the board. 
Oh, it's close, but no. Yeah, it was really close. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like it's almost there, right? Circle all the squares that these two pieces have in common or where they intersect. So this queen can move there in one move. So can this one. Draw them all. Fast as you can. Ah! Uh... No mistakes. Go again. What what actually boggles my mind is how good you are at this and how bad you were at that. <laughs> no, because these these two these two visual memory skills are both central to what we do in chess. Seeing where pieces coordinate and also being able to, to visualize when they're moving. Those are the two those are the two big ones. All right, so I'm going to I'm going to put no pieces on the board for a second. Uh-huh. I want you to, as soon as you get to move a piece into the game, as soon as it comes off the back row, uh, it is visible. Otherwise, the pieces are all there. They're just invisible. You play white, I'll play black. As soon as you make an illegal move, the game stops. Okay. Uh, pawn to e4. And I will go pawn e5. Um, knight to c3. I will go knight to c6. Okay, knight to f3. Probably going to fall for some stupid trap, aren't I? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, c5. Yeah, pawn to d4. Four. Bold. It's a bold move, Cotton. Let's see if it works Let's out. see if it plays off. <laughs> I'll, I'll take that pawn with my pawn. Okay. Um, bishop to F. I'm sorry. Bishop to C4. Why did you do that? All right, it's not illegal. I'm not stopping the match. I'm taking your knight. Bishop takes F7. <laughs> it's not illegal. I'm not stopping the match. <laughs> uh, king takes. Queen to D5. Nah. You think you got me? Yeah, this is the you don't you do not know this gambit? I don't know any gambits. <laughs> what are you talking about? Knight to F I'm sorry, knight to G five. So you're actually calculating stuff. So when you can see these guys, you play them really, really well, right? Mm-hmm. So I guess I have to play knight to h6. Yeah, fine. Queen takes bishop. <sighs> play it because your king doesn't exist yet. All right. Queen is moving into the ball game here. Bishop to e3. I think maybe you were trying to hustle me. I was. <laughs> I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll show you that game. What gambit is later. happening here? <laughs> I'll show you that game bit later. What is happening here? <laughs> yeah. Pawn, move my pawn forward. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Queen takes c3. So where are the rest of your pieces that haven't moved yet? Um, I, I'm, I'm free to cast. I'm free to castle. I have a knight on b1. Um, I don't have pawns on d, e. Um, but I have pawns on the, everywhere else that haven't moved yet. And then I have a rook on a1. Um, you're missing your f7 pawn and your e7 pawn. Um, your bishop, your, your light square bishop's gone. 
Oh, uh, I've never been so wrong about something in my life. You you see this stuff. I don't know what's going on. Why? How come you can see it sometimes and not other times? Though? What do you mean? I don't understand. Like I'm looking at the board though. <laughs> you just had you just had a, a moment there. But I can't do. I can't. You, I can't. I can't do it on that. We cleared that the, we cleared the board. It it made you look away. Okay, so you have to have some kind of visual 